Just want to switch it up, do something new for you guys. Always trying to make some uh, cool content, some cool pieces for you. What's up everyone, welcome back for another episode of Throwy Tuesdays. This is now officially the 10th episode. This week's request comes from Eron. Eron asked if I could paint the word blarf. Um, I, don't, I don't know why saying that word just makes me laugh. Uh, I, don't, I have no idea why. I don't know if it's like a maturity thing or or what. It's just uh, such a funny sounding word. If you guys want to join our Throwy Tuesday or Throwy Thursday series, uh, be sure to drop a comment below of a word you'd like to see me paint along with a color you'd like to see me use. That way you have your chance to see me paint your word. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's jump into it. All right, so i um, loaded up the game. I'm in the level. Um, so now I'm gonna start doing Blar for Eron. Um, for this one, I don't think Eron had any colors. Um, I'm kind of just feeling like a classic black and white throwy but I'm gonna add a little twist to it. I'm gonna add a, a highlight color that I don't think I've done yet on my channel. Um, or even if I have, I think it's just really cool for you guys to see. Um, so yeah, now let's do a Blarf throwy for Eron. Um, and this time what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do a backwards B, why not? right now I was feeling a classic throw you now want to do a yellow and blue outline it's just the weirdest thing I have like these sporadic urges to I'm just like I think of something I'm like oh I gotta see how that how that looks um, so you know it now and this might look a little bit more I don't know, cooler I guess whatever so I'm gonna do a yellow and blue throwy gonna have like kind of like a uh, Golden State Warriors feel accidentally totally not on purpose but those are like the exact colors I'm thinking of so Eron if you're not a Golden State Warriors fan I'm sorry I did not mean to do this just want to switch it up do something new for you guys always trying to make some uh, cool content some cool pieces for you This is. I'm seriously just painting and just creating whatever I want, which I think is that in itself is just dope. Um, and that's what I really like to do when I paint is I just like to have fun. So, is this a throwy? No. Is this a bomb? No. Is this a piece? No, not really. But um, is it graffiti? Yes. And I think that's what's cool and that's what matters most i mean for us graffiti lovers at least all right so i got my piece all outlined uh now let me choose a blue start outlining this bad boy oh, i kind of like the smurf i'm gonna go with the smurf um all right let's do this So weird looking, I love it. I love it. See, this is why I love experimenting and, and trying new things. If I would have stuck to just like the black and white classic throwy like colors like that I was originally thinking, I wouldn't have found this cool color combination. Um, so yeah, there you go, that was a live 
true performance of like, you know, trying new things and discovering new things and liking, liking it. So, uh, yeah, I'm a big advocate for experimental pieces and uh, really just having fun and winging it, you know, especially with your art, your creativity. You should never hold yourself back or like restrict yourself or anything like nah, life's, life's too short to, to do all that. Have fun and get outside of the box, color outside of the lines as much as you want. It's so weird how sometimes you can spend like so long, you know, do, like developing a piece and not even like it. And then you could do something like so quick and easy and you just like love it. I'm really liking this right now. All right, now, damn, this looks so weird and cool. Um, now I got my piece filled in and outlined. Uh, now let's do the dimensions, and then I'll probably beef up my outline in some areas. So, um, yeah, let's do the dimensions. I don't know if I'm just like dorking out on my own piece, or if like, if my eyes are really like telling me the truth, because I really like this. This is seriously like, this is bananas. I love this so much. Literally, I'm just like doing whatever I think looks right and feels right. And it's coming out looking right. And that's a good feeling as an artist, as a creative. That feels really good because many, too many of times have I been wrong in those scenarios and I beat myself up when that happens. Um, but I think that's what you have to go through as an artist, as a creative, you have to earn your stripes. You know, you have to go through those times where you're feeling kind of like down on yourself. Like, oh, I didn't do as best as I could. I didn't, I didn't execute that the way I wanted to. Um, sometimes you need, you need those down times. That way you could really appreciate the up time and, uh, and you could feel the growth. You know, I could like feel my growth, how much I've grown as an artist and as a, as a writer. Like I know how far I've come because of my mistakes. So to be able to now be able to make like less mistakes and feel more of those positive moments, yeah, it feels really good. Oh man, I think now I just want to do the counter of this A. Big bad Eron. Uh, let me switch to the New York fat. Grab that color, make sure my pressure's up. And let me do a nice tag for Eron. Eron underscore. Giants for Eron. All right, so you guys made it to the end of the video. As you guys saw, the piece, it transformed and morphed quite a bit. Um, I started with a black outline. I don't know what it is, that's just how I am. If I feel a certain way at a certain time and I feel like I just gotta switch things up, I gotta try these colors that just came to my mind, then I'll just do it. Um, so I hope you guys liked how that came out, the kind of spontaneity of it all, and um, yeah, just really switching it up. So um, yeah, I encourage all of you, when you're doing the same, when you're sketching, when you're painting, just have fun and just do whatever you want. So yeah, Eron, hope you like this piece. Um, hope all you guys like this video. If you guys are liking our videos, be sure to hit that like button, drop a comment below, and as always, subscribe. We have new episodes every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Thank you guys for tuning in, and we'll see you guys next week. Thank you. Peace.
It sound right, boy.